Hey, Eugene here. In this video, I'm going to be calling back some of my leads. I was in Mississippi when I was making these calls, so I was under the gun. I had said on the camera, um, taking the video of me uh, just calling leads that were generated a little while ago, I wanted to make a video showing that it doesn't really matter if the lead is new or old, that you can have some really good conversations. And so in this video, you'll actually see me talking to leads that were generated back in October, November, December of last year so they're now four months five months old and i just want to show you that uh, as long as you know what you're trying to say and the approach that you're trying to make and you just stick to what you know um, you are going to have results right it's just talking to people talking to people talking to people and so in this video notice how i have to go through a couple conversations until I was able to actually find uh, a good one. Uh, all in all, it took about 15 minutes to get this lady on the phone. And uh, this was a Monday when I was making the calls. By Thursday, I had written her her policy. So if you like this kind of content, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. I am going to be putting more content out like this uh, to help you uh, with your phone presentations. And if you need help with leads, if you want to know how I generate my own leads, if you want to know where to get data and, and how to find people to talk to, uh, all that information is going to be in the description below. So hit that little arrow, uh, which will open up the, the menu where you can actually read how I generate my own leads for my agency. In addition to my different businesses that I have, I actually write full-time also. So if you, if you need help or if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out anytime. Hope you enjoy this video. Thank you. Call number one seven. I mean, I'm calling. Hello. Please leave a message. I'm calling people turning 65 in the middle of the day. It's a little bit tougher. I like to call T65 in the evening, so a lot of them are not picking up the phone. But hopefully for the sake of this recording, we'll get one. But I'm doing the same thing every agent does. Which is Call has been forwarded to an automated... Making phone calls, making phone calls, making phone calls. Hello? Hello? It... Yes? I was trying to give a call back. Is this... Carol? No. Oh, um, she spoke to my assistant about the information she's getting in the mail about her Medicare enrollment, and I was just trying to give her a call back. Oh, you, uh, like you, a medical, or I don't understand, sorry, excuse me. Med again, yeah, yeah, Medicare, Medicare. So for Carol, she, she spoke to my assistant, so I was just trying to call her back. Do you know Carol? Yeah. No, I am Michelle, not Carol. Oh, okay. No, I have, I'm looking for a no, wrong number there. Okay, sorry. Sometimes you have that come through. Hey, you reached seven oh eight six seven five three oh nine. Hello. Hello. Uh, Mr. Person? Yeah. Hey, this is Eugene giving you a call back. I don't know if you remember. I think it was November or something, you spoke to my assistant about the information you've been getting in the mail about your Medicare enrollment. Do you remember that? We sent you some... I do not. We sent you some information in the mail about your Medicare enrollment. Um, okay. Are you are you going on Medicare for the first time coming up pretty quickly? It's already done. Okay, you already took care of all that? Yeah. yeah. Um, are, did you stay with uh, your employer or did you go with some kind of a Medicare Advantage or Medicare employer. supplement? Stay with your employer? Yeah. Okay. Have you have you done a side by side comparison of how your employer benefits uh, work? I'm, I'm not interested, brother. Okay. Thanks so much for trying. You're have welcome. A good day. You too. Bye. -bye. Bye. I pressed one of these buttons right when somebody picked up the phone, and it was like wah wah wah. <laughs> hey, remember that song? Drowning deep in my sea of lonely. No? Will you give it to me? Hello? Hello, Mr. Yes. Hey, sir, this is Eugene trying to give Chris a call back. Yep. Is she, uh, is she available? Yes, she is. Hold on. Thank you. Hello? Hello, Chris. Yep. Hey, this is Eugene giving you a call back. I don't know if you remember... You spoke to my assistant about the information that you're getting in the mail about your Medicare enrollment. 
Um, it was it was a little while ago, and I think you were new to Medicare last year. Is that right? Yeah, but I don't need anything now. Thank you. Well, and that's not that's not the purpose of this call. I don't need anything now. I just put her as not available. Maybe she'll need something later. Hello. Hello. Can I help you? Yeah, this is Eugene giving you a call back about your Medicare benefits. I don't know if you remember, you spoke to my assistant a little while ago about the, the changes to Medicare. Do you remember no, that? I don't remember. It was a little while ago. You you were new to Medicare. I, started on, I just started on Medicare. That's what I'm saying. Yes, in December, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Now, did you go with a Medicare supplement plan or a Medicare Advantage plan? I don't know. I just gone because I have TRICARE. So okay. I just have TRICARE and Medicare. That's all I need. Right. So so folks who have, and I, I specialize in, in working with um, former military, military retirees and spouses of military. Uh-huh. And and so you can have TRICARE as your secondary to Medicare. So Medicare A and B is your primary. TRICARE is your secondary. But there's a lot of benefits that you're not getting that, that you, you could get um, in addition to TRICARE that, that would not cost you any more money. So, so what a lot of well, people I'm not paying anything, but for Medicare right now, that's all I can afford to pay. So. Well, and that's, that's what I'm, that's what I'm mentioning. So, so you, what you would have is Medicare A and B, um, then you'd have your TRICARE, but then we can actually get you more benefits and get you some of your Part B premium back as well. So, so that Part B premium, that $170 a month or so that you're paying, um, there are ways for you to qualify to get some of that money back, which will in turn give you more benefits uh, in addition to your TRICARE. So you wouldn't have to pay anything more and you'd get that $170 back, assuming you'd qualify for it. Has, well, how has, do you qualify for that? So that, that's the reason why I was calling is, is I wanted to ask you a few questions uh, to see if maybe that's something that you'd qualify. And it's, this is not a sales call, so I'm not going to try to sell you anything, right? I'm not trying to take away your TRICARE. I'm not trying to take away your Medicare A and B. So it's not one of those calls. What I'm going to do is I'm going to ask you just a few questions about your situation and see if you can qualify to get your Part B premium back. And it's all based on on income and possessions. And then um, you can apply for more benefits. So you'd have your TRICARE, but in addition to your TRICARE, you you can have some extra benefits on top of that. Would that be okay? Yeah, but... um, um I don't, I don't really, I mean, it'd be nice to get some of that money back, but you know, I don't, I don't pay for TRICARE at all. Well, that's what I mean, but you are paying for Medicare and so that $170. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Um, Well, let me ask you a few questions and then uh, what I can do is I can give you a call back with some options to see if if maybe you can qualify for that. Um, Now uh, that $170, you just pay for that out of your social security check? Yeah, they just take that automatically. Okay, and are you um, are you drawing any uh, other retirement benefits in addition to Social Security, or Social Security all you have? Retired. Yeah, I'm retired. Retired. How how much do you think you're getting in addition to your Social Security per month, like a total? About, um, I probably won't qualify because I get about. Um, Probably about thousand. I, I probably won't qualify. Yeah, because they the, the the Part B premium give back. They um, yes, you you'd have to make less than that. But in okay. addition to your Tricare, you can have extra benefits like gym memberships and meal delivery services at no extra cost, and all that would be in addition to your Tricare, um, because your your income is still within the parameter parameters of of qualifying for some of those extra benefits, and they don't cost anything extra to what you have now. I don't know exactly how much, but I I probably make too much. Right, but but you're still within that threshold of having those uh, zero premium plans. If you'd like, I can I can send you some details on that. Do you use uh, email or text? Yeah, I use both, but I can give you my email address. Yeah, what's your email address? It's uh, at Gmail. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to, um, for, first I need your uh, verbal written permission, right? So before I can, because with Medicare and, and the CMS guidelines, which is the parent of Medicare, if you will, um, 
I can't just be sending you this stuff with, without your permission. So I, I would need your permission first. And it's just a little document, it's a permission slip, slip um, that you would just basically put your name on there saying that it's okay for me to send you this information. So I'm going to send that to your email first. And then once you get that email, if you can give me a call back, and then I can go over all the extra benefits with you. And they they want you to want me to give you my they send me stuff of Medicare every day in the mail. Correct, but for an agent to actually go through it, so this is uh, the, the government. You know how it is; <laughs> they make things a little bit harder on us. Um, so I'm just going to send you one document. All that document is going to ask you is for you to type in your name, which I already have, right? Uh, it's not going to ask you for any other personal information, none of that stuff. But it's going to you're going to give me permission to then go over those extra benefits with you. Well, um, I, I have a question. Sure. So, um, why, why are y'all trying to help people get more money out of, out of Medicare? What, is, what do you all get out of it? Well, so it's, it's insurance, right? So, so it's additional benefits to your TRICARE. And so, okay, it, it, so it's insurance, but that I will have to pay for that, right? That's right. Yes. So have you heard of like, um, have you seen those commercials on TV that talk about extra benefits in addition to your Medicare? Mm, uh, the meal one with, uh, JJ Walker and yeah, Joe Namath. Guy. Yes, exactly. Oh. Yeah. So there's, so, so a lot of people go, who go on Medicare and especially and the reason why we specialize with the TRICARE and the, the VA uh, beneficiaries is because a lot of people think, oh, TRICARE is all I need. It's got everything covered and I don't want to talk about anything else. But what they don't realize is the government has additional benefits that you're that you could qualify for. And sometimes you get some of that one hundred and seventy dollars back. In your case, I don't think you qualify for that part of it. But you mm -hmm. can have additional benefits in addition to the TRICARE that TRICARE itself would not offer to you. And so that's what we try to go over. Yeah, but then y'all, yeah, okay, but then I might be getting some money back, but then I still got to pay out of pocket though, right? No, ma'am. No. For insurance. Mm -mm, no, a lot of these plans you would not. And that's the, that's what I wanted to send you. So I wanted to show you all the plans that you don't pay any anything in addition to Medicare and you can still get those extra benefits. Yeah, but I mean, but you have to pay for insurance. Well, it's a, it's a little bit different when, when you go on Medicare because that Part B premium, that, that amount that you're paying for, for Part B, that $170 a month, they use that money to, to help pay for some of those extra benefits. But it's nothing extra out of your pocket. So there's nothing well, more that you would pay. C? That's what that is. Yep. So that's Part C, Medicare Advantage. That's all those commercials okay. that you're seeing on okay. TV. Yep. And then they have a Part D too, right? Yeah, but you don't need Part D because you get you get your uh, prescription drug plans through your Tricare. Oh right? yeah, yeah. Tricare. So, so you wouldn't need Part D, but the Part C is what gives you those extra benefits known as Medicare Advantage, and that's what okay, I wanted to I'm go over with you. Yeah. I know they had a couple more. Yeah, no, the the Part D. Uh, so the other thing is we cannot give you more benefits than what you're allowed, right? Mm -hmm. And because you already have really good solid benefits through Tricare for your prescription drugs. We, we don't want to um, take that away, clearly. And I, so you would I, not need Part D. You would, we'd only go over the, the Medicare Advantage part of it. And that's, that's what actually you, I don't know if you remember, but you spoke to somebody out of my office regarding that when you were first eligible for Medicare, when you were um, back in November, December, when you were first signing up. Mm -hmm. and, and that's why I'm following up on that. So what I'm going to do, I'm, so it's, it's at Gmail. I'm going to send you that permission slip. If you can just send it back. Do you have a pen handy? Let me give you my phone number so you can call me back. Okay. Whenever you're ready. And if you want, I can also just text it to you too if it's easier if you want me to oh, send. Yeah. Okay, just, okay, what is it? It's uh, a... And my name is Eugene. Okay, Eugene, is this the same one like like my sister? She has a she's just on disability. Okay. But she she gets like an extra. Mm -hmm. But she can go to the drugstore and buy like a hundred dollars worth of stuff a month. Right, those right, those are extra benefits and that's what I was talking about. So so each company under that part C, they have extra benefits that you may be eligible for. 
And what I would do is I would search your zip code or right. Um, and I would uh -huh. search your area of, to see what plans offered those extra benefits like your sister has. Oh, that's why they said check your zip code and see if you qualify. That's right. Yeah, yeah. I see those commercials all the time, but I said, oh, that's just more money. No, ma'am. So there's a lot of those plans that don't cost anything extra at all. And that's what I, so, and that's what I told you before. I'm not, this is not a call to try to buy, have you buy something or have you pay more than what you're already paying. What this phone call is, is about is, is to help you get those extra benefits without paying anything extra for them. And that's what I want to mm -hmm. do. So if you, if you, I'm going to send you that now. Um, and then just whenever, whenever you get it, if you give me a call back, I can then go through all the extra benefits with you. I just, I need your written permission before I can do that. And it's basically okay. all those commercials that you're seeing on TV. That's, that's what that's uh, in regards to. Okay. Um, and so again, like, like I said, my name is Eugene. Now this phone number, the nine, that's your house or your cell? That's my home number. What's your cell? I'll send you a text message with my information also. <laughs> you don't text yourself very often, do you? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> um, but I'm going to send the, uh, what you going to text me? I'm going to text you my my name. I'm going to text you a picture of my license so that way you have that because I want you to know that I'm a real licensed agent. And then I'm going to text you as soon as I've sent that permission slip over so that way you know you got it so that way you're just not sitting around waiting until it gets there. Okay. Okay, I'm ready. The phone number that I gave you, that is also my personal cell phone. Um, so I'm, I'm not going to spam you with all kinds of junk and stuff. I just want to send you the information you're asking for and then, uh, show you how you can qualify for these extra benefits. Okay. Okay. All right. So I'm a, give me five, 10 minutes. I'm going to send it and I'll send you a text message that it's done. And then whenever it's convenient for you, just give me a call back and we can go over those extra benefits. Okay. Here, give me, that's my sister's name. So I won't, I won't forget that one. <laughs> all right. Okay. okay. Thank you. Bye-bye.